Mexico continues to be growing, uh, growing the market for Montana farmers and the entire U.S. wheat industry. This week, leaders from both countries met in Cancun for a special Mexico wheat trade conference hosted by the U.S. Wheat Associates. The Montana Ag Network's Russell Nimitz has more from that conference. Well, Montana farmers continue to raise some of the highest quality wheat and barley in the entire world. That's why it's in such high demand these days by international flour millers and bakers. And a growing market for U.S. wheat and barley is Mexico. Here in Cancun at the U.S. Wheat Associates Mexico Wheat Trade Conference, Chris Colstead, the U.S. Wheat Associates chairman and a farmer from Ledger, Montana, explained to me why Mexico is so important to U.S. farmers like him. Well, Mexico has been a, a good friend of ours for a lot of years and uh, they're our southern border friend and uh, they're one of our top five importers of, of U.S. wheat uh, around the world, so a very important market for us. Francisco Salas is a wheat buyer for Harinas in Chihuahua, Mexico and says they appreciate the long-standing relationship with the U.S. wheat industry and depend on U.S. farmers to help meet their customers' expectations. Well, we have a long history of using U.S. wheat in the northern part of Mexico. Since we are really close, a uh, lot of the procurement of wheat we do, uh, it's from uh, the railroad coming from Kansas into El Paso and then into Chihuahua, which is not far away. So we have a long history of getting wheat uh, from uh, Kansas, northern Oklahoma and, and Texas. And uh, it's a relationship we cherish a lot. We, we've been doing business from a long time before, and we're looking forward to uphold that for years to come. As the population continues to grow in Latin America, Montana Wheat and Barley Committee board member Denise Conover from Broadview says she sees a lot of opportunity for U.S. farmers. We may not ship a lot of wheat to Mexico out of Montana. We do a lot of barley, but that helps our our producers across the United States with supply and demand and we all know that drives our prices so anytime we can sell wheat as out of the U.S. that's a good thing for everybody. As for the future of the new USMCA, attendees here at this conference remain hopeful that in the end all three countries will ratify the new trade agreement therefore paving the way for increased export business for the entire U.S. wheat industry. In Cancun, Mexico, Russell Nemitz, MTN News. Thanks, Russell. Both American and Mexican wheat leaders say that they will want to keep the channels of communication open to help ensure that that working relationship continues into the future.